decided to uh, submit a, a request for the Navy and the Army Band to come and work with our students on a more one-on-one -on -one level. And uh, PSG or the College High School was lucky enough to get both of those to come and do a special one-on-one -on -one class for our clarinet students for the Mighty Bear Band. And so today um, we got to hear some professional musicians and get some advice from them, uh, like I said, on a more one-on-one -on -one level. With all of everything that's going on, we can't go give concerts and do classes in person. Um, this is kind of an all, like an alternative to connect with people. And in that same light, being musicians, um, connecting with high school students who enjoy music. You know, it's not about always becoming a professional musician. It's about loving music and becoming better at it can help you enjoy it more. I think it's just important to show show the value of music and the best way to do that right now is on the computer screen it was a really amazing experience that i probably won't forget for a while because having people from this like from there actually come to us and help people like that i know like my friends that was honestly an amazing experience my favorite part was when they taught us about the, the performance anxiety because honestly i have a lot of that and i'm pretty sure a lot of people have that as well so that's one of the things that like i like carried from it our goal is is to you know give somebody the curiosity. Maybe they heard something today that another student asked, or maybe they heard something that one of us had played, or they're thinking to themselves, "What? How am I doing that? You know, in my own prep, playing or practicing, and how can I change that, or do I need to change that?" And so I just want the curiosity to be there and give them more options to how they can you know express themselves through their musicality. <laughs> Like yeah. That. In the situation that we're in, it's kind of an awesome thing that we have that opportunity for them to, you know, they're in Washington, D.C., and our students are getting to interact with those professional musicians, whereas if we were not in this situation, we might not have that opportunity. So I just, I kind of hope that they see that there's life outside of their band hall, and I hope that they see that fine arts can take them to a lot of places and have a lot of opportunities for them. And I hope that they just have a good appreciation, a better appreciation for music in general and for playing their instrument in general and and that it's a it's just a good thing to play an instrument and have a good feeling about it.